Everyone broken, everyone lost, everyone giving everything you got. Everyone trying, don't you stop? No, don't you stop? For everyone calling out in vain, everyone living with hurt and pain. Everyone. Hi everyone, welcome back. Back out again. I'm in another field today, different to the field I was in in the last video. Thought I'd have a go. I haven't done this field very much. Um, and I'm onto the first signal, so I'll spin you around and we'll see what we've got. All right, here we are. This is the first signal, and I think it's in that. It was a 70s, 80s. Oh, it's falling apart. 70s, 80s. Oh, it feels heavy. Oh, it looks like slag. Yeah. But uh, it's heavy, so it's probably bronze slag. It's quite heavy. It's not lead. Yeah, right, on to the next. Right, I think if I remember rightly, this one was in the teens so I was expecting foil but it looks like there might be a bit of dark soil oh was it in that yeah oh yes it's highly mineralized around here the soil was it that yeah it's whatever that is or is that the imprint no that's the imprint yep definitely the imprint so where's the actual thing gone Oh, it's in there. Oh, what's that? Look, it fell in there. Oh, no idea what that is. Oh, it looks kind of interesting. Wonder if it's a bit of a buckle or something. Cool. On to the next. All right, here we are. This one was a seventy-eight-ish, and it's in that. I can tell without even using the pinpointer. Oh. What is it? Oh, it's a knob. Small little drawer knob. Can I focus? There we go, little drawer knob. Right, on to the next. We've got one here that was uh, 60s, 70s. I think it did jump around, but I can't really remember where to. I jump around. I jump around. Right. Uh, that will be why it jumps around. Bit of aluminium crappy with a bit of iron on. Fantastic. Right, on to the next. Right, we've got one here that was a uh, 60s, 70s. It's there somewhere. Oh my dear, am I going to find anything good today? What is that? Oh, it's a window catch. Let's bash all the mud off it. There we go. It's a window latch. Rubbish. Right, on to the next. Alright, here we are with another one. This one was uh, 50s, 60s. And it's down there. What is that? Oop. Oh, God almighty. This field is literally full of crap. None of the other fields are, so it's quite strange. Right, on to the next. Well, that was a 50s. Whopping great pile of rolled up, well, folded up lead. Oh, there we go. And it's raining, and it wasn't forecast rain till one o'clock. And it's pretty much just gone quarter past ten, so that's that was a lie, wasn't it? Right, on to the next. Right, back with another one. This one was mid 60s. I think it's in there somewhere. Please don't be iron, I just saw a bit of rust. Ugh. Oh, it so is, isn't it? Yep. Yep, another huge bit of iron. Great, on to the next. Well, I've come back in the field I was in the other day where I had the two medieval, well, post medieval Tudor spectacle buckles. I just had no luck in that other field, it was just crap. I was digging up foil, cans, all sorts of crap, so. 
I'm going to take off from where I left off because I'm gridding these fields because they're, they're quite thin fields, they're only about two acres each I think maybe, I think they're two acres, yeah. But let's see if I find anything else and I'll see you on the first hole in this field, cheers! Well here's my first hole in this field, I think it's going to be crap because it was, oh, there's something there. I just put the pinpointer, the no word of a lie, I just found something there. But I just put the pinpointer in the hole and I can see the rim of something right there. That looks like a coin. So what's this going to be? Oh, that's a surprise. Can't be a coin spill, surely these were ploughed. Oh, there's a maggot. <laughs> oh, is that a nail, really? Yeah. There's a nail and there's a coin in the hole. First signal. And it picked it up through the iron, obviously. Alright, let's have a look at the coin. Yeah, pretty sure that's a coin. Get in, first hole. Alright, on to the next. Alright, well this one was uh, 60s up to about 79. And it's there. No idea what it is. Pin. Oh god, the wind's quite strong. Oh no, it hasn't got a pin, it is just. Oh, it is just crap. It's a bent piece of metal. There we go. To the next. Right, here we go. We've got another one. Right there, I could already see it because of the ball. Turn that off. Let's see if we can get the ball out. Right, it's in there. Can you see it? I can't. Crack it in half. Come on, be round. Oh. It's round, but I wanted this to be good. I can already tell what it is. Can you tell what it is? It's a Victorian umbrella slide. There we go. Hole in the middle. Victorian umbrella slide. Cool, on to the next. Well, I think you can see that one. That rang up 60s to 70s before I dug it, and then after I'd already plugged the hole and unplugged the hole, it was in the 90s. But still, it's not iron, it's copper. On to the next. Well, I popped this one up and I saw a tiny little green imprint there, but then it's actually in the hole. Whatever it is. Oh my god, it looks like another folded up bit of copper like earlier. Yeah, it's exactly the same. Exactly the same, just a pointy rolled up bit of copper. In fact, that, yeah, it is, it's just rolled up. I thought it could have been a, a hook, like a, what do they call them? a rail hook but it's not. Right on to the next. That one was a 72. Nice well square rectangle bit of lead. Right on to the next. Say I will not be broken, I will not break, I will not crumble under my weight. Anything you throw at me I can take, yeah I can Well, I was just doing a bit of videoing of me swinging when obviously you saw me at the end come across the signal. Here it is. There it is. What is that? It has a silver look to it. Oh, it's got a hole on either side. Oh, I wonder what that is. I might have a clean, clean that. It's probably aluminium or something. All right, I'll clean it and come back. Wow. There we go, I think it is silver. 1832, and it says Charles, it looks like Charles something tonk, tonk but it could be Tonkin, because that's a, a common name around here. I'll definitely have a look closer when I get home. I can't tell what that middle initial is, but yeah, it looks like a silver plaque. Oh, <laughs> well chuffed, all I wanted was a bit of silver today, so I'm really happy with that. I can't see any hallmarks on it, 
on the back or anything but I'll definitely give it a clean up and I'll put a picture in of it cleaned up well happy with that I've got a signal right behind me as well because I couldn't find the signal that I found while I was videoing <laughs> right on to the next Oh, well, I'm not even bending down for this one. It's just a bloody moo tube. A cacamoo moo! <laughs> Thank you. That's a bit of a take on uh, Manic and Morley's. That is just cacapoo poo. All right, on to the next. All right, this one was quite jumpy from 60s to 90s. And when I popped the plug, it was in the 90s, so. Half of me is saying I ain't, but it looks like it's in a clump. Oh, how is that 90s? Well, looks like a coin. Oh, a bit of wind just came. Yeah, looks like a coin. Ideal, second coin. That'll do me. Yeah, that was that ran quite high, that 90s. I mean, it's only maybe five inches deep. Oh well, cool. On to the next. Alright, that's the end of that hunt. Another one finished. Happy to get the silver. That's my first first silver. No, it's not, because I've got the hammered. But it's my second silver with the simplex on land. But it's my first silver item, you know, um, artifact. So I'm happy with that. I'll clean that up. You'll have already seen it. So until next time, thank, thanks everybody again. I'm up to 370 subscribers as of this morning, so I'm happy with that. Thank you all, and I will see you next time. Cheers!